I touch you touched phone. me about ten times, dude. I'm, I'm playing basketball. All right, either you're gonna beat me up or, or whatever. But I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna silence my free speech because you have a problem. Yeah, you are. Yeah, you no, are. No, I, it's all sorts of things. <laughs> if you want, breathe. Okay, yeah. you're being stupid. You're being. Stupid. Would it make you feel better if I open the glove box? Or? That's what I'm wondering. Yeah, could you open the no, glove box? No, I'm not gonna open the glove box. I don't answer any questions. I don't answer any questions. Yeah, I, mean, I don't answer any questions. Okay. Besides, officer, I don't uh, answer any questions. You don't answer any questions? No, I do not. All right, here we go. We got a whole nother reaction video, and this one is coming from my man, Sean Porter, known on YouTube as Mr. Porter. You got to check him out. This is a, a one-man protest that come with the power of 100 people. My man stands out. He's known all across Maryland and D.C., the whole DMV, basically. Um, he holds uh, he holds these signs up, and he's pretty much protesting what our government officials are doing with a four by eight sign. And yes, they are extremely vulgar. Yes, they got curse words. They're nice, big, bold, and bright, and it's one hundred percent legal. It does get a reaction out of people, and it does give him a perfect chance to exercise his rights, and he does it well. In this video here in Frederick County in uh, Linganore, uh, near Lake Linganore. He was um, he was protesting, and I've seen the first I've seen this video up into a part because when he originally dropped it, I watched it, and I when it got to a certain part, I immediately called him. I thought we I said, oh, we gotta go to war. Let's go. We gonna protest our ass off now. So let's get into it. It's a real fun video. He's a real fun channel. His link is in the description. Please go check it out, and you gonna want to go check it out after this. I promise you. What's up, buddy? You wanted me to come back, you said, right? Look, if you want to do something, go right ahead. I'm standing right here. I'm not leaving, and you're not getting my sign. Ugh. You almost got hit by a car. Why you got to do it when kids are here, man? And that's what the sign says if you guys want to know why he's upset. Suck my dick, Larry Hogan. Go fuck yourself, you Nazi cunt. It's an $800 sign, buddy. And by the way, what he's protesting are the mask mandates that are that were at um, were shutting down businesses and had so many people out of work. And That's what he was protesting with the sign. And it's a lot more than that to it than that. Please go to his channel. He does a great job of explaining it. Dude, tough as hell. Look at him. He's like five six, little tough boy. <laughs> I'm sure you would. It's a free country. Now you damaging my sign. You're the guy in that SUV over there. That SUV right there. Why you doing? No, I'm not listening to shit, buddy. Four two two two. Get the frick out of here, y'all! Right now, Jim. Jim. Get the frick out of here! <laughs> you hear her? Covering your license plate now. That's how you sound when you pretend to be tough. Yeah, good luck. Two. EH4. I got half of it from the back. It's gone. I think you can get the fuck out of here. No, I'm gonna get your license plate. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. Quit assaulting me. Just, I'm not assaulting any. I didn't I'm not touch moving. You. I didn't touch you. Why don't you get out of here? Yeah, take the okay? Side no, our, I'm not our, going anywhere. Our community does I'll not. I'll be here every day for a year now. No, because of this. Yes, I will. No, you won't. Watch. You will not you be, will here, not be okay? here, okay? I will. No, you won't. Take some pictures. Hey! No, let it, let it, let it, let it. Yeah. Turn around and 
button. Just get the fuck out of here. Just go. Get Just off my go. phone. I'm not on your phone. Am I? Hey, why are you touching me? I'm not. I didn't touch Dude, you. Dude, get your arm off of me. I didn't touch you. I didn't touch you. You trying to block me from getting the tag? Smart. Hey, you're touching me. You're I grabbing touch my you phone and touching me. I did not touch you. You touched me about ten times, dude. I'm, I'm playing basketball. All right, either you're gonna beat me up or, or whatever. But I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna silence my free speech because you have a problem. Yeah, you are. Yeah, you no, are. I'm not. You are in front of my kids. You're gonna. It's so a free country. That's the problem. We ain't asking you to silence your free speech. We're the last ones they gonna tell you to silence your free. speech. He literally just said, "You are gonna. I mean, you're gonna silence your free speech from the children." And then this guy says, "We're the last ones who gonna do it anyway." I just wanted to point that out. Speech. We are the two last ones in this neighborhood to tell we you. We fucking love America, America, and we are Republicans, and you are ruining it. <laughs> and look how short he is, bro. He's so short he can't reach the he couldn't reach the camera. <laughs> I'm saying, why do you gotta have you are ruining freedom it. of speech? We believe in that. I'm on a public roadway. This is actually this no. Is it's it's a public, 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 public easement. I already checked with the county on February 10th. I talked to Dave Owen with County Roads. Can I yell at you? Yeah. You've yelled the whole time, so no, have you. Actually, I haven't yelled at you. The guy that keeps assaulting me, the short guy. He has to ask the The big guy doesn't assault me. The little tiny guy is also tiny guy. assault. <laughs> your fucking ass if you want. Yeah. Breathe. Okay? Yeah. You're being stupid. <laughs> You're being stupid. No. I'm not You're being really stupid. You're stupid. So my question mind. is, why do my kids have to see what you're saying? Because it's a free country. Okay. They can watch someone OD on the corner. It's a public road. It's public easement. Okay, so okay, that that's why I've been here for seven hours because it's legal. That, that makes it right though for the little kids to see it. You're doing it at a certain time. My kid is not afraid of certain words. Sticks and stones will break your bones. Yeah, my words will never hurt. Yeah, but I don't need my little girl to see. My it. little eight-year-old. Then, you, then you, you don't have to look at it. It's a sign. You can we look at it or not. See it, it come across from it's school. a free country. Yeah, I, I know it is a free country. I'm very aware it's a free country. I really. So this is what's wrong with this situation. <laughs> they did the same shit. That some police do, they 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 escalate it and they threaten with violence before. Now they want to have a conversation. Now that now that they the intimidation tactics didn't work, now they want to have a conversation. And I know Sean personally, so I can't say he would have moved if they would have, you know, <laughs> came and expressed their feelings. But at the same time, he would have listened. And he would have had they 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 would have. I'm sure they would have had a better conversation and a better. I don't even know how this turns out, but they, they would have had a better day. I do know that the police were involved. Why it is a free country? Why? And, which is why I'm not telling today. you that you shouldn't do it. Why did you do this? You again? guys just stole my sign. Broke in half. First off, nobody it stole your anything. sign. You did. I, I, it's broken. It's broken in half. You I stole it. it. Okay. So. Okay. You did. I've got a video of you chase going down the road with my sign. Right, I'm getting it off the roadway. No. Exactly. Hey, you just hit my phone again. No, Stop it, and you're drunk. You hit me. Oh. You hit me. No, I didn't hit you. You did. You touching me. You're full of shit. It's all on video. Yeah. So can you explain to me why you feel the need to do it when the kids are coming home from school? Right. I've been out like here all you're... day. Exactly. I do 14 hours at a time. Okay. That's... It's called daylight. Okay. And daylight doesn't it? matter. Why are you yelling? Whether there's kids here or Why not, it's yelling? still legal. I'm within my rights. If you don't like it, don't look at it. I'm asking Why do you hate free person. speech so much? I don't. That's my whole point. Well, then why did you just attack a guy with a sign and think you were going to get away with it? Tell me when I attacked you. I'm Rewind sorry. Your, your, your partner. No, he didn't your attack partner. you. He grabbed the sign out of my hands. No, he didn't. Yes, he that's did. That's a lie. Your sign was on the ground. No, nice try. I was holding your on to it. Your sign was on the ground. It was, it was litter. On the ground. He was picking up litter, man. You're Star. so full of crap. It was on the ground. It's not going to work. It was on the ground in the community. That's all. And you're part of it. Then you hey, yo, the, isn't it crazy how they narrated their situation? A lot of people go to jail because shit is narrated the way that they, they the way that they say it. They know what they did was wrong. And if it happened to them, they'd be acting like complete victims. He didn't. He been swinging, pulling on his arm, hitting his phone. And, and, and I don't know if y'all going to be able to see how good this camera quality is. It looked like a nice phone. It's actually, <laughs> I'm actually impressed with how good it recorded. Dude right here even got a decent haircut, for real, for real. I can see every wave and hair in this shit, but this is crazy how they narrated it. And if the camera wasn't there, who knows? Part of what? The community that needs to be taken out. Silence free speech is what you're saying, right? That's not what I'm saying at all. Dude, like we just said, 
We are fellow Republicans. We are Americans. Why do you hate free speech? We, we love don't. free speech. But what I have I will a not be intimidated, buddy. So you I can't beat me up or whatever it is. You I'm can't do shit. Beat you up. You, you just said you were going to kick my ass like 30 seconds ago. He definitely did. Dude, that's the problem with videotape. It, it shows everything. Good, good. So it does well, show everything. you keep that so in your computer. That he didn't snatch the sign out of your hand, nor right. did he assault you like you said about nine times. Repeatedly hitting my hand and, and the, grabbing my you, camera. You pushing your phone towards his hand? Not that's true. That's not assault, Slim. Not true. Okay. Well, we can look at that on video, too, if you want. It's all on video. I know it is. That's great. Do you know what disorderly conduct is? I do. Okay. Uh -huh. So why I, did I you partake in it? Content. Why did you partake in it? You guys came to threaten me? <laughs> no, it's mostly your little guy here. It's not mostly anybody. He didn't threaten you at any point. He did, repeatedly. When? When you chased him? Uh, he, he stole went. my property. No, he threw trash away. It was on the side of the No, road. no, he, he stole my property, him. and you know it. It's on video. All right, so... so look, you can just keep at, walking on. At this point... I stopped the video, I called him up. Hey, bro, what the hell happened out there? Oh, you saw the video? So Sean getting telling me. So I can't really, all he did was tell me the ending of it. But I was like, hey, bro, where'd you go make the sign? I actually went to the sign place to get one made. The sign was like, I was getting one. If the one I was going to make wasn't as big, but I was on some I wish they would when I was out there. Cause they ain't going, they ain't going to play me, play with me like that. Once you put your hands on me, I'm, I'm going in his mouth. I'm not, uh, uh, I'm not going for that. And, and, and Lil dude, uh, Lil dude make you want to just make you want to fuck him up. But anyway, <laughs> I called him and I never finished this video. I just, um, I just, I, cause he had told me the ending of it. You know what I'm saying? And I never finished it, but we about to finish it. All you want. I mean, it's fine. What are you going to fucking do to me? Nothing. Oh, I ain't doing shit to you. I know. Neither is any fucking buddy in the law department because I ain't done nothing wrong. Okay, your buddy. He ain't done nothing wrong either. So grabbing the sign and running down the, the street with it. The sign on the ground. You put the sign on the ground. It's my private property. Don't it's try it. to say it's litter. You know better. But, but do I? You know better. Do I? Yeah, you do. Do I? Absolutely. I was True. holding it True. when you drove up here and when he yelled. No, you were holding your phone filming us when you came up here. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So the sign was on the ground. And it was trash. It's not trash. Yeah. This is a petty no, ass argument. private it property, and when I told you to stop and to give it back, you continued going. That's theft. Because it could have blown it. It is theft, and it's over three hundred dollars. Do you know how much that fucking sign cost? Obviously, over three hundred dollars because you just said that. So Absolutely. You pay Are you a cop? Huh? Are you a cop? Couldn't tell you if I am or not. You look more like a military guy. Do I? Yeah. Okay. So anyway, I'm not leaving. I'll be I'm here. I'll be here really. for another year. I don't of want you to leave. I actually enjoy the fact that you protest. Then why did you come over here with little little guy here to try and intimidate me off the corner? Because that ain't gonna work. I'm to intimidate you. What makes you think I just wasn't? Oh, this guy's talking about kicking my ass because of the sign and his kids seeing it. I didn't hear that. I didn't hear that. It's on video. Uh, your eight-year-old, some about your eight-year-old daughter yeah, or something. No, I asked. Does not deserve to see suck my dick when she's coming around the corner on the bus. Yes. That's what I have a problem Sorry, with. Sorry, it's public road. No. Now, I think we can all agree with the morality in their point. They definitely went about trying to get it across the wrong way, but I definitely think we can all agree with that. But, uh, Sean's right, too. It's 100% legal. <laughs> it's a, a completely legal protest. What can you do about it? And, this, and, 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 and I first, when I first found out about him and the sign and all that, I thought the same thing, but then he was telling me, he was like, bro, you drive around here, you see dope fiends leaning, passed out. You know what I'm saying? You go, you get the occasional person who high running around naked. Kids see that too. You can't shield them for everything. And he damn right. You know what I mean? I take it as a time to explain my, um, explain, you know, the um, the Constitution to my kids. Yeah, that, that that's basically the only way I can do about it. But hey, that's how they feel about it. Oh, that's public road. What you have I'm to allowed to be there. Side, no. The that cops came repeatedly because there was no crime and left. They didn't even bother talking to me because they know better. Okay, it's not my first rodeo, buddy. Okay. We, okay. we, we understand. Oh, man, I'm going to come back. I'm going to come back every single day starting Monday for a year now because That's of awesome. you. Just so you know. That's crazy, awesome, man. I'm only asking why you choose to say stuff like that when you know at a certain time the kids are coming through. I've been here all day, buddy. The kids weren't here in the middle of the day when I showed up. yelling at me. I have not yelled at you yet. I have not. I have been here all day. Look, I have. Get on me for a second. Yeah, my 
Actually, it was lock, 130. Lock it on me for a second. I haven't yelled at you yet. I haven't threatened you yet. I haven't done anything to you. No, have I? you have not. Have I? No, you're so fine. I, can you have a disciplinary conversation with me for just what one minute? Disciplinary a disciplinary conversation? conversation? Disciplined conversation. Okay. Two you mean like two adults? <laughs> I was about, about to say. He acted right, like a minute ago, grabbing my side. Forget he's standing. Does he want to apologize? Seriously. I'm not Does he want to apologize? Man, I'm asking you. Can you lock in on me for a minute? I'm not apologizing for picking up Can you lock in on me for a minute? Can I ask you to completely stand behind your one your, your First Amendment rights? However, when the children's school buses come through, can you lower the signs so my kids don't see? Dude, I didn't see a fucking bus the whole day. All right? I, I don't know if they're distance learning. I know, Sean, personally, if that man would have said that, he he he. he I, I I do believe he would have do do it. I put my money. I put my bets on him just lowering the sign for the kids. And to be honest with you, to be honest with you, and he ain't out there raising it for the kids to see it. He's not protesting for the kids. He knows what he's protesting for. He's well versed on the law. And Sean is not playing about his politics. You will see that when you get to his channel. They're not in the sky, but I don't care either, motherfucker. All right, be it's free country. I because you're acting like a motherfucker. You're asking me to refrain from free speech no, because you have children's sensitivities. You if they go to public school, they're hearing worse stuff than that. It's not that they no, hear it. Yes, Facts. they are. Facts. Public Facts. school. It's not that they hear it. Not Absolutely. Told, buddy. It's they're not that they hear it. It's just respect, man. I wouldn't do something that disrespectful to you. Okay. How is it disrespectful for me to see your sign? If, if you had a sign. If you're and you're a minor for no First reason. First off. That's your belief system, not mine. I don't believe the words on there are vulgar, and they hold no meaning to me at all. If they hold no meaning, why are you holding the sign? Then? Because they seem to hold a heck of a lot of meaning for Larry Hogan, whom I'm protesting. He already man? did, and I already talked. Uh, yeah, well, Larry Hogan saw your fucking sign. Are you fucking kidding in me? In Ocean City. You are fucking stupid. In Ocean City. Hey yo, hey yo, what? Hey yo, why did he get so angry? Yo, why did he just get so angry? All right, Sean. If you live in the DMV and you and you and you in the news a lot, Sean is man. He, he's all over the news with this shit. If you pay attention, he's all over. Larry Hogan definitely knows about his side. I can promise you that. <laughs> he's at the state capitol with that sign. He everywhere. Trust me. But I don't understand why dude just got so pissed off. Hey man, let's let's finish this shit. This shit is funny as hell. Fucking ignorant motherfucker. You know that? You really, really are. Okay. Big well, dude was keeping day. his cool for well, a little bit. Going nowhere. Well, I'm going back to protesting. Oh, and I won't that. stop. You do that. I hope you choke on a bag of dicks. <laughs> really? Yes. I hope you. How's that for free speech? I hope you choke on a bag of dicks. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That's hey, yo, he is. big mad. This is the type Get of the people we're fighting right against. against. He is big mad. I wish I kept watching Get this the whole shit. Brand. You're not fighting against me. You had me on your team until you started acting like a dick. I don't believe him. Oh, he tough video. too. Good. He tough too. Oh shit, he tough. The police. Oh shit. Hey guys, back up, please. Okay, okay guys. guys. So, so the deal is this. This is, this. Um, this this is, is the. the uh, 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 damage, uh, damage the guy did to the Larry Hogan sign. And, and for people just tuning into the channel, um, this is the Larry Hogan protest sign. It says, suck my dick, Larry Hogan. Him, and then it's Hitler giving a speech at the Reichstag. And go fuck yourself, you Nazi cunt, and it's dripping blood red. Anyway, so as you saw, the guy, he had come earlier and said he was going to beat me up. And I said, well, get out of the car and beat me up. And then he wouldn't. So he left. He came back like a half an hour later. He was actually drunk and um, or had done shots or something. And he, had, he brought this really big guy to serve as backup. And the big guy was actually not uh, in the uh, breaking the law type of mood. I think he was former military or current military, but... He, uh, yeah, he didn't he cause any problems, problems really. really. He's just, you know, mouthy. mouthy. But, but uh, uh, anyway, so the cops came. came. I shut uh, the phone off, off and I was immediately able, able to replay for the cops the whole thing. And they're like, okay, okay you know, theft over $300 because, uh, you know, the sign costing 800 bucks. Um, you know, whatever. Um, it doesn't cost 800 I was just, I was just fucking saying that for dramatic purposes. I know, I know. Uh, anyway, the, uh, 
the theft, the malicious destruction of property, assault on multiple instances because he kept grabbing my arm and the phone. And I kept saying, you know, you're, you know, you're grabbing my arm. I was narrating just so any idiot watching could see what was going on. When he grabbed the sign, he almost got hit by a white Dodge truck towing some kind of a motor horn. Like, literally, the guy had to slam on the brakes. Um, and I think that's when the damage happened. It was broke there, and then I broke it there later because it was weekend. And I stayed for several hours afterwards just to show them that I would not be silenced and they'd have to kill me to get me to stop protesting whatever pissed me off that day. The reason why I came out of retirement was the HOA in the Lake Linganore Association was lying to people saying that the no commercial signs of any kind covenant also extends to political signs and graduation signs. And they tried to harass my dad and I told them what the law was and that they were full of shit and they didn't get a two thirds vote so that they couldn't make a rule like that because there wasn't a two thirds vote in the, the, the HOA, the members, um, so that it was bullshit and they left my dad alone. That's actually why I went out um, and did Lake Lunar before where the extreme Karen came and tried to block the sign with her spandex. Um, this, this incident here, um, one of my friend's girlfriends uh, had like a sign in her yard and the HOA was bitching about the happy graduation sign saying that signs are not allowed in the community. And everyone got so pissed off that they weren't allowed to have graduation signs. They're like, well, okay, but only for 10 days after the uh, event happens. And, you know, they're just making up arbitrary rules. HOAs are stupid. So as punishment, that happened on uh, Wednesday. So as punishment, I went out there on Friday and made sure that, you know, people knew free speech was allowed in Lake Langenor. And, um, so the cops are like, what do you want to do? You want to press charges? And, and I said, no, I'll tell you what, just if that guy apologizes, it gives me $20 for the piece of wood he broke. Uh, we'll call it a day. So they went, went over and the guy, he looked very traumatized to do so. He, he seemed upset that he was even offered that. And then he relented, came over, apologized, gave me $20. Uh, for the wood. And then I handed it back to him. I said, it's not about money. It's about free speech. And then I walked away from all of them. And then the cops stayed and uh, they guarded the giant suck my dick Larry Hogan sign. Um, I don't know, probably about an hour and a half after the incident. I stayed there for, I don't know, two hours, two and a half hours um, after it happened. But, uh, you know, I'm just like, hey, beat me up. You know, don't, don't just say you're going to beat me up. Just go ahead and do it. Uh, but no one will. They'll just like, you know, try to take the sign. You know, act like little kids. Um, it's really bizarre. Uh, you know, they say they're gonna beat me up, and they won't come anywhere near me. They won't swing on me. They, you know, they go behind me and grab the sign when I'm talking to the big dude, which is what happened with this little dude. You can tell he's got some sort of Napoleon complex going on. Nothing against little people. Um, but anyway, yeah, that's that's what happened. So the Larry Hogan sign is now going back in its resting place next to the porta potty. Uh, facing, uh, facing the neighbor's driveway, driveway so they get to drive, to drive back, back and forth. They get to see that uh, every day. Uh, they love it. Hey, yo. Shout out to my man, Sean, yo. This shit is crazy. And and, and, and y'all heard it at the end. You know what I'm saying? He had a... He, 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 he's doing this. Let me, let me let y'all in on something. He's doing this because he truly believes in it. He, he has a... His YouTube channel is popping. He's not even monetized. He, those signs are not cheap. He has multiple ones, and he, <laughs> they're not cheap. He's not in this for the money at all. He wants people to. He makes it clear that he's not in it for the money. He's really strong on his beliefs. That's why I say this one man protest comes with the strength of a hundred. But man, I hope y'all like the video. Leave y'all comments about it. Go check him out, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. I'm out.